Charles Stuart was the half-brother of the second Marcus, Lord Castlereagh. Born on the 16th of May 1778 in Dublin, he became the third Marcus of Londonderry. He was educated at Eton College and at the age of 16 was commissioned into the 5th Royal Irish Dragoons and helped put down the Irish Rebellion of 1798. In the year 1800 he was elected to the Irish House of Commons where he sat for the Londonderry constituency until the Act of Union in 1801. He then represented the constituency in the British House of Commons. He married in 1804 Lady Catherine Bly, daughter of the third Earl of Darnley. They had one son, Frederick, born on the 7th of July 1805 in London. Catherine died following a minor operation while Charles was in Spain with the Duke of Wellington fighting the French. As a cavalry officer, he was known by his friends and family as Fighting Charlie. He fought 25 battles and received the thanks of Parliament in 1810. On the 20th of November 1813, he was made Colonel of the 25th Light Dragoons, becoming a Knight of the Bath that same year. He married his second wife, Lady Frances Anne Vane Tempest, on the 3rd of April 1819. She was the only child of the second baronet, Sir Henry Vane Tempest, and was 19 years old at the time. She was believed to be the richest heiress in Britain, and a condition of her father's will was when she married, her husband would have to change his name to take their family name, Vian. Wynyard Hall was the family seat of Frances Anne and became their main residence in Durham. She also inherited 65,000 acres of land in the northeast of England, which included coal mines from which she received an annual income of over £33,000. She also inherited property and lands in County Antrim in Ireland. After the Napoleonic Wars, Charles was appointed ambassador in Vienna and Berlin, and both he and his wife Frances Anne spent a lot of time on the continent. He became the third Marcus of Londonderry after the death of his half-brother, Lord Castlereagh, in 1822. In 1842 he was appointed Lord Lieutenant of Durham and the following year became Colonel of the 2nd Regiment of the Lifeguards. He was made Knight of the Garter in 1853. Charles and Francis Anne purchased a London residence in Park Lane. The couple had six children. Their eldest son George became the 5th Marcus of Londonderry and their eldest daughter Lady Frances Anne married John Spencer Churchill, 7th Duke of Marlborough and was Winston Churchill's grandmother. They purchased another residence on the Durham coast and extended the house at Mount Stuart in Ireland. Frances Anne built a summer residence, Scarron Tower, at Carnlock on the Antrim coast. In 1845, work commenced on a new central hall and east wing at Mount Stuart to join the west wing built by the first Marcus. The portico entrance at the west wing was demolished and a larger one constructed at the new entrance to the central hall. The third Marcus built docks at Seam to export coal from their 20 inland pits. 
He also constructed the Londonderry, Seam and Sunderland Railway in 1853, increasing the productivity of their coal mines. The revenue from the pits increased to over £55,000 per annum. The third Marcus of Londonderry died on the 6th of March 1854 and was buried at Wynyard Hall in Durham. Francis Anne had a monument built in the main square at Durham. It depicts the Marcus as a cavalry officer.